Hey there, YouTube fam! Welcome back to our channel, where we dive deep into all things health and wellness. Today, we're going to discuss a topic that often goes unspoken, the impact of medications on sexual functi. On. Yep, you heard it right. Medications play a crucial role in managing our health, but it's important to recognize that they can also come with some unexpected side effects. And one area that can be significantly affected is our sexual function. Let's dive into it, shall we? First up, we have antidepressants. While they are vital for managing mental health conditions, certain antidepressants, like SSRIs, can cause sexual side effects such as decreased libido, delayed orgasm, erectile dysfunction, and anorgasmia. Yeah, it's not ideal for anyone seeking sexual satisfaction. Next, we have antipsychotic medications. These powerful drugs can be life-changing for individuals managing conditions like schizophrenia, but they can also have an impact on sexual function, decreased libido, erectile dysfunction, and difficulty achieving orgasm are some of the challenges that may arise. Now, let's talk about antihypertensive medications. Managing hypertension is crucial, but certain classes of antihypertensive drugs, like beta blockers and diuretics, can contribute to sexual dysfunction, particularly erectile dysfunction. It's a tough choice to make between cardiovascular health and sexual satisfaction. Hormonal therapies, such as androgen deprivation therapy for prostate cancer, can also have an impact on sexual function. Reduced libido, erectile dysfunction, and overall sexual dissatisfaction can be challenging for individuals undergoing these treatments. And let's not forget about birth control pills. While they provide an essential contraceptive option for women, some hormonal contraceptives can cause decreased libido and vaginal dryness, impacting sexual desire and arousal. So, now that we know the common medications that can affect sexual function, how do we address these side effects? Well, my friends, it's all about recognizing, exploring alternatives, and finding solutions. First and foremost, it's crucial for healthcare providers and patients to have open and honest communication. Discussing potential side effects and concerns is the first step towards finding a solution that works for everyone. Sometimes, a simple adjustment in medication, such as switching to an alternative within the same therapeutic class, or adjusting the dosage, can alleviate sexual side effects. Working closely with your healthcare provider is key in finding the most suitable medication with minimal impact on sexual function. In some cases, combining medications or therapies can counteract sexual side effects. For example, using medications like sildenafil, commonly known as Viagra, can help individuals maintain their sexual function when experiencing erectile dysfunction caused by antidepressants. Engaging in sexual counseling or therapy can be incredibly beneficial for individuals and couples facing sexual challenges caused by medication. Therapists can provide coping strategies, communication techniques, and exercises to enhance intimacy and sexual satisfaction. Lifestyle modifications are another avenue to explore. Regular exercise, a balanced diet, reduced alcohol intake, and effective stress management can positively impact sexual function and mitigate some of the medication-related side effects. And let's not forget about non-pharmacological options. Incorporating mindfulness, relaxation techniques, and sensual activities into your daily life can enhance sexual experiences and compensate for medication-induced sexual dysfunction. So, my friends, it's vital to recognize and address sexual side effects of medications by fostering open communication, exploring alternatives, making lifestyle changes, and seeking specialized sexual counseling, we can effectively manage medication related sexual dysfunction while prioritizing our overall well-being. That's it for today's video, folks. If you found this information helpful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more insightful content. As always, take care and be kind to yourself. Until next time, stay healthy and stay happy.